The next step I will use elbow here we really where is the attachment of quadriceps like this I will apply initial pressure I transmit pressure from my body and slowly stretch and digging in stretch shift and digging in three four times gradually increasing pressure and stretch And this technique is actually kind of contributing to muscles and fascia. At the same time, digging deeper and deeper, pressing against. Mm -hmm. We did here middle strip. Now the other strip here. Again, shift. You see, shift. If I will, you see, I shift and I release this jumping. Uh, it's like a turban. This tissue very elastic. Shift, whoop, I'm right now exposing deeper layers of muscles, in this case junction of tendon muscles. Yeah. And again, shift a little bit. Yeah. We, I don't release. If you will pay attention, see if the pay attention on this part. Right now I will release. You see this jumping. I mean I start with shifting. I, f I finish my three, four kneading techniques, digging. I move a little bit, but shifting, do not releasing. You see, I stay under shifting. Strips, we're doing strips. You see, I start here, I did first strip. I did here, I mobilize strips. It's absolutely topographical term and meaning. It's not anatomical, just to cover all area of front eye. But these techniques with this shifting, applying pressure and mobilizing deep layers of muscles and stretching fascia actually causing both release within fascia and muscles. Yeah. And pressure should be significant, but please do not activate pain analyzing system. And during three minutes, you will do these pumping techniques. You have to pump and at least three minutes. Next step, you just will push venous blood and fluid. Proceed after pumping. Proceed also for approximately three minutes. The next step, we here, this is the tibial bone, everyone will pull pee. We will, a little bit, will shift, shift connective tissue and compress. Three, four movements. Again, you go to the centers, you shift, 
and you compress. Now, in this position, you're kind of grabbing with both hands. You see the anterior part. You're grabbing, and by closing like this with hands, you're creating a lot of stretch effort of connective tissue. Superficial fascia. And like this, what are you doing? And hold. Like you can hold like this, you can shake even, will cause a lot of fascial release. 